This week on The Choice. Get the hooks. Everybody get their stuff. Let's go see if we can stock up on this alley here. Like Mac Daddy, Gator Man. The choice is about three things. Real honey, going after the animal of your choosing with the weapon you love. Real adventure, from the mountains of Canada to the deserts of Mexico. But most of all, it's about real people. Hunters with families, jobs, and dreams. Their skills will be put to the test. Every situation is different. Success or failure. It all comes down to the choice. Drop it. That one's for you. Oh, yeah, baby! <laughs> Welcome to this week's The Choice. Yes, we are. We are in the eerie swamps of Florida, yes. chasing swamp, swamp lizards, lizards and, and swines. Really? Yeah. You're gonna Sounded like, cool, didn't it? I'm going to start gagging. You've got so much fog going on out here. But this is natural. Don't. This is not. Don't, this is natural. don't let them think it's not. I mean, <laughs> okay. we're sitting here. This week's lucky logo is Realtree. Realtree, the ultimate in camouflage concealment. Blends in anywhere, anytime. Let's just watch for the logo. We'll tell you what to do at the end of the show. Ralph here, my husband, seems to think that we need to gag on all this fog. <laughs> Let's just get going. We've got Darlene and Paul from TC, us, maybe Cam. I mean, we got a little bit of everything we going everything. on. We got a little bit of everything. A bunch of swamp lizards, a bunch of swine going down. So let's get going, shall Let's we? go. Let's, let's waste go. no time. <laughs> Jeez, I can't breathe. We just pulled, we just unloaded the bad boy. We've got Darlene here from TC. She just loaded her gun and we pulled into the first field and there is three or four nice size hogs. They're about 250 yards from us right now. So what we're gonna do is get behind some brush and pull the bad boy up there as, as close as we can. And My first hog. Yeah. Awesome. One shot. It Look dropped it. Girl. You smoked it. That was great. <laughs> you are the One shot. You said to be a killer. <laughs> I took out some frustration. I'm feeling better already. <laughs> Good pig. <laughs> well, guys, I'm here with Darlene Small from Thompson Center. Just shot her first hog on her first hog hunt, the first day, the first five minutes we're in the woods. 
The girl is lucky is all I can say. Congratulations. Thank you. It was great. <laughs> awesome. Oh, so this is your first go. You just said something about your dad was a hog hunter. My dad is an avid hunter and worked at TC for 45 years. Oh, yeah. And he passed away a couple years ago, and my mom told me on the way here he was sitting on my shoulders during this hunt. Okay, he <laughs> he told me when to pull the trigger. He was there. Oh, that's great. It was fun. I loved it. <laughs> Good shot, darling. We're down here in Osceola Outfitters. We're down here with the posse. We're getting ready to go out and do a hog hunt. I'm looking forward to this. We got the new Thompson Center Dimension Rifle, and we get a chance to see what it can do. We're having a great time. Can't wait to be out there with these guys, and we're ready to hit it. This wind is going to change when that sun comes up, so I think we're just going to cut right straight to him. Ordering away, he'll turn. If he throws his head up real quick, be ready to go. Wind's hitting us right in the back. He's gonna smell us in the back. Side there. Now you want to take him, take him. I can still see him. He, he made it to the edge of those woods, but I lost him in that fog right there. I seen him, I seen him when he hit the edge of the fog, and I kind of lost him, but it looked like he was stuck. The hogs hit, but it, it made it to the edge of the woods over there, so we're going to give it some time. When you saw him weaving, he stopped on the edge, and I could see the round of his back, and he stood there for maybe a minute, and then, I don't want to say he went down, but he disappeared. I mean, he could have dropped, he could have went in the woods, so. Uh -uh. Nice, nice dude. Good job, Paul. All right, hey, thanks. This is awesome. This is awesome, awesome, awesome. <laughs> you know why they're in here? It's just right here. See these? Yeah. Palmetto berries. Yep. They'll start eating those things anytime. <laughs> they love them. Love them. Congratulations. That's just a good lesson, man. Don't pull your shot because you got to work that much harder to get it. <laughs> Although I got to tell you, it's the first time I've ever hunted a, uh, behind dogs. Pretty cool, ain't it? What an adrenaline rush. You get in there and all of a sudden things goes, and it's right there and, and you have no place to go. <laughs> Hey, thanks. This is awesome. This is awesome. Remember, do not slam the doors. We're at a low voice right now, okay? No, no loud talking. 
and we're going to sneak up here. I want everybody single file. I want RJ behind me, the other two behind RJ. Say it, Case, you and Fish are behind RJ, okay? Get the hooks, everybody get their stuff, and let's go see if we can stock up on this alligator. Good shot, Thank just you. like always. You're like Mac Daddy, Gator Man from Illinois. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all think you can hold him up? Yeah. Get get a leg. Yeah, there's only three legs. Come right here, RJ, and you get him right around here where I'm at. Case, come on this side. Get both jaws. Okay. All right, fish. I think we're getting set up here, buddy. Let's get in the shade right here. That way we got a shot at that corner. And if he rounds this corner, we got a shot, all right? We need to drop these down. I'm, we're gonna try to shoot from you know what, let's shoot from a standing position and get a little more angle. We're by the power lines, there's a gator right around this corner. And we're gonna hit the call, see if he'll come around. If he does, we'll get him as close as we can. We'll let him stop and bust him.
Nice, drive it out there to him. He killed that one. That one's <laughs> dead. Is. Drive it right yeah. There. Yeah, baby. Yeah. yeah. Let's go. <laughs> Vengeance. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> that was quick. <laughs> that was too. <laughs> All right, what, what's happening is a uh, fish just killed an alligator right here. And we didn't realize it, but whenever whenever Jimmy come back over to me, he's working the call. He said there was two more coming down the canal from the far end. So what we're going to do is we put Case on the gun. We're going to see if uh, he can get a gator now. We're going to start all over the whole process. We got the boat in the water. We got the other gator floating out there. Hopefully we kind of got some something that get the other gators can look at so we're ready to we're ready to start going here Look at that! Let's go. Let's Woo, go. Yeah. There you go. Man. Go back out there for Seems round two. Big. That's a bigger gator than I thought. Ooh. Great shot. Good. Nice. Right there. Going back out there for round two. All right. Give me some man love. Let's go. Good job. Good job out there. Hey, grab the tail. Oh, oh fish is dancing shot. with them. Another one down. We got a fish down. A fish down. Fish uh huh. Down. Who fell down now? Wow, I know. we guys. <laughs> Let's go, Casey. Good job, Casey. Hey guys, we're proud of you. Yeah. Nice Casey guys. Five, Good job, six guys. And a half. Six and a half footer. Yep. And six the other one's seven and a half. You done? Yeah, it's Man. about the same size. Yeah, buddy, awesome. awesome. Thank you. They're pretty much both the same size, pretty much. Yours got like two no, inches. No, yours is smaller. You can say it. <laughs> I don't know. Just the tails are like two inches smaller. Man, we've had a big morning. Yes, we, we have. have. Here's your leg. Oh, heavy in it. Pick up the tail. There you go. All right, slide the other one over. Pull the other one over. Here, I'll hand this one up. Okay. Right now, I gotta do this all by myself. Up in there, RJ. Oh, RJ, get in there. This one wait, should wait, be wait. Hey, hey, fish. Hold on, hold on. fish, wait. Let RJ get in there and help Casey. I'll do his back. Get a hold of something when he does. Get, get a leg. Grab a leg. There you go. Oh, that was a lot of help there. <laughs> there you go. Okay, cut the fog. <laughs> yeah, thank you. That fog sure. was killing me. Oh my gosh. But at least it got you in the mood, the emotions. You know, I mean, Darlene, Paul, and everyone, they, they, they felt <clears> it. <throat> they were down. They were the choking on that flo- smoke that you had going on out here. It was horrible. I'm like, <sighs> but honestly, we had a lot of fun. We always have fun down there with yep. Hop and Oscar. It's a outfitters. target rich environment. It for is. Sure. And we go down there and we know that when our freezer's looking a little empty, we can go down there and fill it up with some yep. really good food. Yes? Yeah, I'm not a big fan of Gator Tail. You know, you're going to get a lot of complaints about that one. I know, just I know so a lot of people, I just, mm, yeah, okay. Okay. Hey, this week's lucky logo was Realtree. Realtree, the ultimate in camouflage, concealment, uh, blends in anywhere, anytime. <laughs> if you happen to see the Realtree logo, you need to log on to choicetv.com, click on the lucky logo button, fill out some information. Someone's going to get some great stuff from Realtree as well as some of our other manufacturers. Now, next week is it. Next yes. week is incredible. You need to get the whole family. Call all your friends and your families because this is what it's all about as usual on the choice but it's a very special time. We've got RJ, 
Case, and Fish, all going up to South Peace. To their very first bear hunt. Ever. So this is gonna be a lot of great, it's gonna be a lot, it's gonna be a great show. I can't talk. The fog, it's gotten into my brain. I am in a fog. Thanks for making your choice. The choice. <laughs> we'll see you next and, week. and I choose to take the fifth on you that should. one.